I'm very happy when I'm singing and, and I said, this is what I do, this is what I love. I have a lot of dreams now because of my music, of what I'm doing. I just want to get into all of the hearts around the world. The industry in the U.S. is separated, but of course for the future I want to be the Latin singer for everybody. I think that's the hardest part. Tenía aproximadamente cuatro o cinco años, ya vi que la música para la niña era algo muy importante. A ver, en Carol veo mi reflejo eh, musicalmente porque es la, la hija la cual siguió los pasos míos. My father, he always wanted to be a singer, so he was very happy. And my mother started crying and she said, you are going to make the same mistake as your father. Papá la apoyaba y yo era la, la cortante. My mother was very, very upset. My sisters, they were like, no, Carol, no, please, no again. But it was my dream. I have been in this industry for 12 years. In Colombia, it was very hard for me to get into radio stations because of the kind of music that I choose. I am an urban singer, and for people in Colombia, they told me like, you have to do pop, you have to do another kind of music. So it was very, very hard. I think it was the hardest part of my career. I remember one day, somebody took my CD and told us, do you see something here? It's a girl singing reggaeton. That is not going to happen. I know she wants to take over the world. Um, there's not too many female acts, especially in her genre, and she sees that. Carol represents a new school, a new hybrid of, 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 of artists. She's one of the few artists that can actually sing and rap. I mean, you see artists that, they're the duels, and you got one guy that's a singer and one guy that's a rapper. Well, Carol is a female act that could actually do both things. Coming from where we come from, in Colombia, and being able to you know, splash some of the fresh sounds and, and textures of, of what's going on today. I think that's what's going to make it that much more special. Nobody in the United States knew who I am. So now they see the numbers on YouTube or they see that something is happening. So they open the door and say, OK, Carol, now you can talk what is happening in Colombia because we are interested. U.S. radio is not easy. She needs exposure, she needs to be in the country, she needs to be doing promotion, she needs the hit single, she needs to be out there working every day. I miss my family every day, but I think I have to work hard. I have to leave that for a second and keep going. Forty years ago, everybody was an idol because there aren't a lot of people singing. But now it's a lot of competition, so you have to push harder than before. We're going to radio station, to TV shows. I'm very happy. It's my first promo in the United States, and people are very positive. If we want to make it, we have to keep going this way. The first time that I knew one of my songs was in the United States, I got out from the airport. I got in the car, and then like my song started on the radio station. And at that moment, I couldn't like believe that that was happening. It was happening at that moment. La barrera uno se la pone, entonces simplemente como uno concientizarse, saber. Yo sé que va a ser duro, yo sé que va a ser difícil, pero el día que una mujer lo logra, lo logra al triple porque obviamente los méritos y los honores son más, entonces yo creo que vale la pena. Cuando la vi allá, en un evento de esos tan grandes, de la magnitud, ya la vi como una estrella, total. People are believing in what I'm doing, so when they see urban music, urban artists, men, 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 now it's Carol G, now it's happening, something is happening.
no here in Colombia, I think around the world. Do you know an uncharted musician whose music deserves to be shared with the world? Email artists at whoisuncharted 